Now, moving on to our second story of things with the trend, we asked President Muhammad Bari, Dr. Masai Tok say administration, so far they don't secure about 359 convictions against human traffickers. We know say human trafficking, for example, we do Nigeria now something where a lot of state government now, especially those state government, they took her inside. Now, speaking for inside the sixth Interpol Global Conference on top of human trafficking and migrant smuggling for inside Abuja on Monday, the president, Dr. Komasai, talks in Nigeria. Now, one of the first was one of the first C. Buhari, uh, who was represented by President and uh, Permanent Secretary for inside the office of the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, Ulusegu Adinkule. He called for more collaborative efforts. Say we want to make more people join hands together. Or may they fight this human trafficking where it don't actually come and ties out with Nigeria. And so far, we don't actually arrest some people and uh, where it took their hands for inside human trafficking. In his own words, quote unquote, he talks say, unless we fight corruption for inside developing economies, like our own dear Nigeria, the little resources so we don't budget for development. They go see the steal them by people where they for inside big, big position. Exposing our youth to poverty and this one go make people want go into trafficking and smuggling. So in commerce, I talk say we need to solve this issue of poverty. Now they say Nigeria and about 70 countries will actually decide to forge a common front against the complex international group behind human trafficking and migrant smuggling. Now, all they won't just come outside tell us, we say, come, Nigeria has still strung their hands concerning human trafficking and smuggling, and they know say this one a major issue, and they need to put a stop to them for inside Wubudu, Ninja. Now, um, this number and a number where people know, people are trying to understand, is this part of the number of people with NAPTIC, NAPTIC, the National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Persons, um, the, the NAPTIC people will not say earlier this year, they come outside talk, say they don't actually capture or actually stop about 342 cases of human trafficking for inside the country. And now with this one, they talk about 359. This 342, are they part of the 359, or is it aside from the one with NAPTIC, don't come outside talk? Now, we not say for our country, human trafficking, even though, even though it took us in an international body become us, I can't expose the things where they don't come outside do. But is this, have we still done enough, enough to make sure, say, the traffickers will be like, say, they look as if they're above the law. Because despite the fact that they nab people, the people where they nab, be like, not the small small people, the kingpins where they're involved are still in this business and they're still making a lot of money. Now, even according to statistics, what they see, they talk, say, for a state like Edo State, in almost every family in the rural area, they get one person where they overseas. Most likely, um, mm. they do they do different illegal things based on human trafficking just to survive and send money back home. And the families don't mind. And why would they still give that statistics? We need to give kudos to the Edo State government because right now, that they put a lot of empowerment um, um, activities on ground to empower the youth of Edo State. So yes, um, why the statistics is there is obvious. Edo State government is still trying to curb human trafficking for inside the state. I like that. I just hope uh, <laughs> we can all keep it up and all the government governors to go copy the thing where Edo State governor, governor they do to make sure say human trafficking go get which you come for inside our country. To enjoy more of this our Ubunke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.